What is up, ladies and gents? How are you doing? Welcome back to another football reaction video. Watching the RB Leipzig and Atletico Madrid game. So this is going to be a heck of a game, but I think Atletico have the advantage here over RB Leipzig. But hey, let's see what happens. And RB Leipzig right there with an incredible chance to be up 1-0 against Atletico, but he just volleys it above the bar. And what a save from Gulacci. Great header by Atletico Madrid. Incredible set. I mean, incredible free kick taken. But the keeper just made a crazy diving save, but... Leipzig so far are in control of the game, but Atletico's defense is making the biggest difference right now because you see what Atletico are doing is that they're defending in their own half and that's how they end up uh, winning a lot of their games is just by defending their own half and not allowing their opponents any space inside their own box. Now, the way how Atletico are playing right now, I don't know why they don't want to go forward with the ball. It seems like they're just clearing the ball and just going back and parking the bus because literally that's what this game has been about. It's RB Leipzig, they've been creating more chances than Atletico, although Atletico had some great chances on the counter. I think Atletico... They need to start going forward too and just instead of just spending so much time in their own half now. Hey, that's just my personal opinion. And so it's halftime right now, 0-0. Zero, zero. And all I gotta say is, is the first half of the game hasn't been really as entertaining as I thought it was gonna be. So I'm hoping that the second half is gonna be more entertaining because the first half it was practically just Atletico defending in their own half and relying on the counterattacks because Atletico, they're just that team that uh, relies on defending deep in their own half and counterattacks in order to win against their opponents. And hey, so far it's working out for them, but but in terms of entertainment, like, I hope that the second half we're going to be able to see some Gs. And there we go, ladies and gents, what a goal for RB Leipzig. Look at that cross inside the box header. There we go, ladies and gents. What a freaking header. Incredible buildup by Leipzig. And they're up. They finally managed to get past Atletico's defense. So one way that you can get past Atletico is just by winning the aerial duel. And look at that incredible finish from that RB Leipzig player. Look at that cross inside the box. Beautiful. Oh, my God. Look at that, man. Just to sneak the ball past Oblak. Hey, RB Leipzig finally up. That's what I'm talking about. It's Atletico. All I got to say is they got to start playing football. Because Atletico, I feel like they've been playing just defense and look what happened this is the result i mean rb leipzig just managed to get that g and there we go ladies and gentlemen atletico are back in the game joe felix gets a penalty and bam there we go sends the keeper the right way but he beautifully nests that pen in and it's one one for atletico madrid so it looks like atletico are still in the game it looks like that finally atletico madrid have caught a break for once so it looks like that after Atletico Madrid brought on Joao Felix, it completely changed the game. And it just goes to show that Joao Felix still has a lot of potential at Atletico Madrid. And without a doubt, he so far has rescued them with that penalty. But it's interesting to see who's going to score that second G right now. Because I'm assuming that this game is probably going to go to extra time because it's the 81st minute, still 1-1. So uh, this is a heck of a game. Second half is way more entertaining than the first half. Just as how I said I wanted the second half to be. Look what happened. It's been entertaining. But I think that Joao Felix, so far, he deserves recognition. Because, I mean, after Simeone brought him on, just completely changed the whole game for Atletico. And just like that, ladies and gentlemen, another goal for Leipzig. What a freaking G. This could be the game winner. Yo, RB Leipzig are doing an incredible job right now. Look at that. Oh, my God. <laughs> What a beautiful strike that was, but what a mega deflection. I mean, seriously, wow. Great strike, RB Leipzig, and it's 2-1. Two, two, wow, impressive. <laughs> wow, whoa, whoa. And that's the game, ladies and gents. RB Leipzig win 2-1 to one against Atletico Madrid. And first of all, that goal by Tyler Adams at the end was absolutely incredible. But you got to feel bad for Atletico, man. Once again, they come up short in the Champions League. It always seems like Atletico just come up short every time in the Champions League. And Diego Costa today, I don't know what happened, but he absolutely just, I feel like, underperformed today. But Atletico Madrid at the end, they were just unlucky with that deflection, my honest opinion. But this was a heck of a game. I really had a great time watching this game. So uh, if anybody that watched this game, let me know what did you think about this game in the comment section below. Let's have a football discussion. But uh, yeah, RB Leipzig, they're going through, man. So kudos to RB, man. Well-deserved, man. They are finally making noise in the Champions League. And I hope you people enjoyed this video. If you did, drop a like, drop a comment, subscribe to the channel, follow me on Twitch. So close to 100 followers. All the support would be absolutely incredible. And as well, who was your man of the match today? For me, it would have to be probably Tyler Adams. Because Tyler Adams today, he scored that game winner for RB Leipzig. And they're going through to the semis right now. So uh, make sure to stay tuned for more football videos, ladies and gents. Y'all have a good one.